Yo guys, check this out. So the Clippers lost to the Rockets tonight in the greatest mini tank job of all time. So let's look at this. Kawhi doesn't play. No Paul George. No Reggie Jackson. Ibaka, 17 minutes. Luke Kennard, 41. Doc, or not Doc. Who's the coach of the Clippers again? Ty Lue. He hasn't liked Luke Kennard for parts of the season, but he loved him tonight. Uh, Zubats plays three minutes. Marcus is at, only played nine minutes. They played Jay Scrub 40 minutes. Who the hell is Jay Scrub? That's like the second best NBA name ever. The point is, is they had to lose to the Rockets because now there's like no chance of them facing the Lakers. Okay, if they would have won this, then it could have been possible because, you know, Lakers, they get the get the sixth seed some way. It was, it was very possible. By losing this game, because the Nuggets have the tiebreaker on the Clippers, there is now like a 0% chance of the Lakers facing the Clippers in round one. Now, before anybody's going to say the Clippers are scared of the Lakers, yeah, no crap. I mean, if you had a choice between facing them in round one or facing the Nuggets without Jamal Murray, you're going to take that. If all you got to do is lose one stupid game to the Rockets. Hmm. The other thing I want to notice, let's see, Rockets 16-54. and 54. Have the Rockets clinched the worst record? They had to have clinched the worst record by now. Oh, see, so for them, it doesn't, the game didn't even matter that much. Yeah, well, good for their guys. They got to win. It was a win-win for everybody. Clippers wanted to lose. Rockets, I mean, they've already got the highest chances of getting the top pick or whatever, the top 25 for the top whatever teams. Uh, so yeah, that's good. Okay, I want to look at something from this game. So we're going to check out some of Kyrie Thomas's buckets. Now, I'm sure the players were at least giving their all here, but you know the front office for the Clippers was basically like, please just do nothing. Well, that was pretty good. Nobody step up on the screen. Well done, everybody, if I can speak properly here. This one's a cut. You, you got to love the nobody in the paint. You really got to love them. Maybe the players were in on it. I mean, with defense like this, I mean, my goodness, Boogie had one swipe and well, that was pretty much it. Uh, you know, maybe they were all in on it. This is an idea, right? If you just tell your players, listen, guys, don't win tonight because we don't want the Lakers in round one. Just, just let them win. Would they do it? I would maybe do it. It would depend. You know, if I was a veteran and I was under contract already, yeah, I wouldn't care. Anyway, uh, Kyrie Thomas gets a Euro step. That was pretty good. Uh, did you think you'd be watching a Kyrie Thomas highlight reel today? I bet you didn't. That actually wasn't bad defense by Ibaka, which is probably why he only played 17 minutes. They had to get him out of there. They noticed that he was guarding too well. All right, that's enough. I've had enough of the Kyrie Thomas highlights. Um, way to go, Clippers, you know. You've guaranteed yourselves not to get the Lakers in round one.